Carlos. We're rolling, okay. Hi, I'm Ben with today's question. What is the common cold? When someone says, I have a cold, what do they mean? What they mean really is that there's something in their body causing a set of symptoms, and we call this set of symptoms the actual cold. This includes things like runny noses, sneezing, coughing, maybe even chills, or a monster of a headache. It does not include a fever. Normally, if there's a fever, we call it the flu. And there are a lot of different viruses that can cause cold symptoms, but about half the time, the cold is caused by a class of virus called a rhinovirus. Like the words rhino and virus put together, but not, not a rhinoceros. That would be way cooler. The rhinoceros, excuse me, rhinovirus, gets into the cell lining of your nose and it starts reproducing. It arrives from other people. So there are some myths we have to bust. One, it is not cold weather that causes a cold. Instead, it's the fact that cold weather causes people to congregate together indoors, and it makes it easier for a rhinovirus to jump from one person to the next. The virus generally moves from someone else's hands to your hands through something like touching a doorknob, uh, putting your hands into your nose or your eyes, which I'm not gonna do, because that would be kind of gross on camera. Your body reacts to the presence of the rhinovirus with its immune system. In the case of a cold, the immune system opens up blood vessels inside your nose through inflammation, and this also increases your mucus. And these two processes give you that famous runny nose and the stuffy feeling, the irritation caused by the virus, and all the fluid causes sneezing. When the virus makes it into the cell lining, then your lungs are gonna start producing fluid and mucus as well. And that's what makes you cough. You're coughing up lung mucus. As the immune system gears up over several days and fights the virus back, this mucus thickens. It gets grosser. This mucus thickens and it changes color with dead cells, uh, a form of pus. That is true. It is gross and it is totally true. But eventually, the immune system eliminates the virus completely and boom, you're well again. You're hale and hearty and ready for some more misadventure. How long does this take? Well, the whole healing process takes about seven to 10 days if you have average health. So that's it. Uh, that's what people mean when they say they have a cold. We hope that you enjoyed this video and we'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Go ahead and like if you feel like liking, if you thought this video was likable. Uh, you could subscribe and we will see you next time.